Hello everyone, this is a quick video explaining the paperwork process. I received a quick question uh, from Carolina. She's one of my students and she asked me about, hello Kamal, this is a great information. There is something I don't understand after the paperwork and the rate confirmation rate is done when it comes um, the delivery process and the invoice. How I will support owner operators with this, I believe, it is also something that needs special attention. And, you know, my understanding from this question is she wants to know the paperwork process. So, you know, getting the uh, rate confirmation POD and how, you know, like, how am I getting paid and how I support my owner operators uh, with helping uploading the rate confirmation in PODs. So let's jump into this uh, slide over here. The delivery, for example, you called a broker using a load board, for example, DAT Power or Trackers H. You see a load board, you called, you uh, negotiated, you booked the load. Now your broker send, uh, sends you the rate confirmation. And load was picked up, let's say, in Atlanta, Georgia, and then delivered in Houston, Texas. Now driver calls you and says, you know, load was delivered, and I'm sending you the uh, rate confirmation and proof of delivery, which is POD. Now delivery is made. Now what do you do? You have this rate confirmation and POD, you have to upload. I'll give you an example. You will be using factoring company. Now, by now you know what is factoring company. And I have my own factoring company. So for each carrier, the factoring company will be different. Why it is different? Here it goes. So I use OTR Capital. So the OTR Capital is my factoring company. When you click on um, the client login, so I'll be providing you username and password. So I'm a carrier, or you can think, uh, think of uh, uh, I'm your owner operator uh, in your case, for example, right? But carrier in general, owner operators and carriers collectively, it means carrier, right? So I'll be providing you my username and password so that you can upload rate confirmation in POD using this portal, right? My factoring company. Why? Because factoring company must receive rate confirmation and proof of delivery so that I, as, as your uh, client or customer, I need to get paid so that then you can invoice me and then I will pay you for the independent truck dispatcher. So let's come back to this uh, slide. Now, Delivery is made, load delivered and paperwork received, rate confirmation and POD, your uploading must be uploaded, right? So we just covered this um, second step. Now, carrier gets paid. So the next day or within the 24 hours, I received a payment for this rate confirmation, whatever the load is. Let's say this load is $10,000. I receive um, right next day within 24 hours, $10,000 in my bank account. Now I'm a carrier, right? So I, I get paid. Factoring company, as you can see, pays the uh, carrier. So now I have my $10,000 in my bank account. Now you're, you are an independent dispatcher. What do you do? You are invoicing, invoicing me, right? Because I'm your client. I'm your customer. So you're invoicing me saying, hey, Kamal, we booked this load for $10,000. 10% is mine. So please give me or pay me the $1,000. So what I do, I clear your invoice by paying $1,000 and you receive a payment. This is the process. Of course, there is like, um, what is POD? And can you show me the example of POD or a confirmation that told a little different story? But this is the framework, uh, how it goes. Hope this helps.